Yo guys, today I am gonna work as a traffic enforcement officer here in Brookhaven and that dude is pretty wild. Okay, we need to actually turn on the emergency lights and see if we can go to pull this crazy guy over. So let's gonna use the sirens and do it. He's actually pulling over. Okay, that is pretty sweet. Let's go have a chat with this dude because he can't be doing donuts in the middle of the city like that. That is crazy, but I do like his car. What's wrong, officer? You can't be driving like that, sir. You're driving like a madman and there's people walking around here, so you're gonna gonna hit some innocent person. Why not? It's fun. Well, can I maybe see your license, sir? I really need to see your license just to see if you actually got your driver's license. Okay, so let's go and see if this gentleman do got his driver's license and this girl is saying... <laughs> What? what? What does she need help with? What do you need help with, ma'am? And yeah, this dude actually got his driver's license. Okay, pretty good. Pretty good. But I think I'm gonna actually write this guy a ticket because he can't be driving like that. Okay, sir. Well, I will actually have to issue you a ticket. So let's gonna issue this guy a ticket. And why did you just fall onto the ground? Bruh! Okay, so let's gonna get the ticket ready and hand it over to this guy. There we go. And he has to pay for the ticket. Sweet. Okay, there we go. And I think we need to carry this uh, random innocent woman over to the hospital because she said help. And then she got of like fell over. So I was gonna help her, dude. Even though I'm a traffic enforcement officer, I do need to help people in need. And what's going on? Why are there so many military police vehicles? I have no clue, dude. Brookhaven is a crazy place today. But that just means we have a lot of work to do. So let's gonna drop her onto this hospital bed and a doctor will probably take care of her, which is great. Now we just gotta head back onto the road, guys, because I see a lot of crazy drivers in this city and we have to enforce the law, make sure that everybody is driving nice and safe in this city. There we go. I'm just driving around Around, and I should probably even equip the police job just so people can actually call me. Why haven't I done that already? I'm not really sure, dude. I'm kind of clumsy like that. So where's the police officer job? Come on, bro. It's right there. And then we need to grab the phone. Okay, so now people can actually call me. And bro, what is that golf car doing? I don't know. It's kind of driving all over the place. So let's gonna see if this guy in the golf car will actually pull over. And bro, is he not pulling over? Okay, let's gonna turn on the emergency lights or sirens, I should probably say. And yeah, let's gonna try and catch up there. Come on, go, 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 you stupid police bike. I was gonna try to pit him. Nope, that didn't even work. Yo, dude, why is this so difficult? I don't know, man. So, yeah, I'm just trying to catch up to this random dude. And, dude, what? He just pitted my police bike. That is so annoying. Okay, where did it go now? Dude, he actually went off-road. So, I was gonna go off-road here. And, boom, dude. Okay, we actually catched up to him, which is great. And now, his golf cart is burning. And, guys, if you haven't already, don't forget to hit that like subscribe button. Anyways, he's going pretty fast over here. So, where's he going now? I think he's driving up towards the mountain. Oh, no. Please look up the mountain, dude. Oh, no. Dude, it just keeps on losing wheels. <laughs> dude, what's going on, bro? I think his car is a little bit trashy. And no, no, no. I'm spinning out with the bike. I'm spinning out with the bike. Oh, 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 dude. I just gotta keep it in control. And ah! Dude, how did I land that? I don't know, but we just did. And he's kind of on the ground. So I was going to get the gun up just in case he's armed. And bro, is that a bacon here, bro? Was it just chasing a bacon around? My legs! Okay, I guess his legs are kind of messed up. But I do need to put him in cuffs, though. He still might be a danger to people. And dude, his vehicle is burning. We need to put out that fire. So I was going to grab a fire extinguisher from the back of the motorcycle. And I was going to put out the fire. Perfect. Okay, now we need to transport this crazy bacon here over to a jail. This guy was literally so 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 crazy and yeah i'm not even going to be taking him over to the hospital even though he's complaining that his legs are hurting i don't care about that bro he put a lot of innocent lives in danger so yeah he's going straight over to jail and can i actually take the police bike inside of this place dude i guess it's actually gonna work let's just go ahead and drive the police bike all the way in there we go okay nice i don't even have to get off my police bike okay nice 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 let's just go ahead and drop him off right here perfect and it's gonna take on out and boom dude that actually worked pretty nice that's the benefit of driving a police motorcycle. Okay, sweet, guys. That was a pretty good one. And you know what? What is going on with all these military police vehicles? I have no clue, dude. It is kind of tripping me out. Why, dude? What's going on here in the city? I don't know, bro, but I think I need to actually have, like, a speed trap. So let's go and go in here, and I'm just going to make, like, a little speed trap. And let's go and make sure that everybody has to drive in here. Nice, because I am a traffic enforcement officer. So there we go. Let's go ahead and, and type in here maybe like a little checkpoint this is a great place to kind of like check and see if people actually do got their driver's license and stuff like that so there we go just putting out some stuff nice okay there we go we do got a little spot right here we're just gonna actually make sure that people got their driver's license and are driving like legally so there we go i do got a little traffic checkpoint here and a week is pulling up and it's a limo slow down slow down okay stop 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 dude i'm gonna have a little chat with you sir let me through i'm the mayor dude rules apply to everyone so 
yeah, do you got your license by any chance, Mr. Mayor of Brookhaven? And he's jumping out, and dude, he actually do got his driver's license. Okay, let's go and let him pass. You can go, sir, you can go. So yeah, please leave, please leave. So that was the mayor of Brookhaven, actually, but you know what? The rules applies to everybody. So yeah, even if you're a mayor, you're gonna show your license if a traffic enforcement officer says so. And dude, who is this random girl just standing here with the money bag? Dude, I think she actually robbed the Brookhaven bank. I don't know, though. I don't got the evidence. And bro, what? Dude, why is she doing that, dude? She's throwing bombs at me? Yo, calm down, man. Calm down, bro. Okay, so people are crazy in the city, but luckily I'm here to enforce the traffic laws. Yeah! Oh, dude, we got another car pulling up, so let's go slow down, slow down, stop it. Yo, ma'am, chill out, chill out, dude. I'm actually gonna arrest you if you don't chill out. Hey, sir, you got your license by any chance? Don't ask my car! Yeah, I told her to stop, dude, but yeah, do you got your license? And I don't have one. Okay, if you don't have one, please step out of your vehicle, man. Please step out. So, yeah, this guy says he doesn't have his license. What should we do about that, guys? I think we actually need to arrest him. That is, like, illegal. So, I was gonna put this guy in cuffs real quick. Perfect. Come on, man! Yeah, sit on my bike, dude. You gotta sit on my bike. So, there we go. He's going over to my bike. And let's just go ahead and park his car. Maybe over by the daycare. There is a little parking spot right here. So, I'm just gonna park his car right there. And you know what? We can go to clean up the checkpoint. And I'm gonna take this guy into jail, dude. He's driving without a license. Isn't that like a serious crime? I don't know, dude. I think it's serious at least. So, let's gonna bring him in onto the police station. And I'm literally driving the bike inside of the police station. Why not, dude? It's fun. I'm just gonna do it because it's fun. So, there we go. Let's gonna bring him into this cell. And he just just jumped out and I was gonna make sure that we close this cell. Perfect, dude. I'm actually doing a pretty solid job today. And who is this guy with the golden suit? It says VIP, bro. Is this the guy VIP of Brookhaven? Hey, dude, what's up? Do you need help with anything? You're kind of standing inside of the police station and it's looking kind of suspicious. So yeah, let me know if you need anything, bro. And it's not even saying anything. Okay, so I'm just gonna let that guy go. He's not saying anything. I don't think he needs help with anything. So let's just gonna take the police bike out for a spin and yo, dude, I'm stuck. What what happened there, bro? I don't know, but I literally got stuck on that little pole thing right there. So anyways, let's go take the police bike out for a little patrol and make sure that everybody has parked correctly and legally. There we go. Okay, nothing going on in this neighborhood. Let's go head over to the next neighborhood and see what's going on. Let's go drive up on here and bro, dude, everybody's like parked legally, I think, but we do got a lot of military police vehicles here. Yo, what's going on? I don't know, bro. It's kind of freaking me out. Should we follow the military police vehicles just to see what's going on? I guess Yes, so, bro. And what about this truck right here? It says legal goods on truck, but it's driving on the wrong side of the road. I think we need to pull this guy over and see what he has to say. Okay, and he is pulling over. Sweet, dude. Let's gonna have a chat with the driver of this truck. And it says legal goods, of course. Hopefully, it's all legal. I don't know, bro. Maybe we need to check the back. What's up? Yo, open up the trailer for me, sir. I I'm just gonna have, like, a little check on the back here. So, let's gonna get the handgun up, just in case something bad happens. And let's gonna get the flashlight attached to it. And, bro, all I see is boxes. It looks pretty legal to me. All good, right? Wait a minute, sir. What's the hurry, bro? Why are you stressing? I think he's looking kind of nervous, bro. Uh-oh. We need to check the back, bro. And yo, dude, he got a lot of stolen goods in here. Bro, that is crazy. We need to arrest this man, bro. Yo, step out. Step out. Yo, dude, he's driving off. He's driving off. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mayday. SOS. SOS, dude. We got an illegal driving off, bro. What's going on there? And dude, he just crashed his truck. What? And his truck is burning, bro. What's going on? There. I don't know, bro. Let's gonna get the handgun and hopefully we'll surrender. Turn around right now, sir. Turn around. Turn around. Okay, so let's gonna see if he's actually gonna comply with my orders. Just let me go. No, dude. Turn around for me, dude. Is he getting closer to me? No. Okay, there we go. He's turning around and I was gonna get him in handcuffs real, real quick. And his truck is burning as well because I shot at his truck. So let's gonna get the fire extinguisher. I was gonna put out the truck fire real quick and boom, dude. Holy cow. What a crazy patrol, guys. People are literally crazy in this city. Anyways, we got to bring this guy over to the police station and get him situated inside of a jail cell because this guy does not belong to roam around free here in the city. So there we go. I'm not going to drive the police bike inside of the police station anymore because the ground is getting kind of muddy from the tires. There we go. Okay, you enjoy yourself in there, bro. Next time, maybe don't try to run away from the police officer. At least not the traffic enforcement officer. Okay, and bro, look at that. There's an abandoned scooter in the middle of the road. We got to get that moved away. So let's just gonna put out some cones while I work here in the middle of the road. And is it locked? No, it's unlocked. Okay, sweet. Let's just go and park that on the sidewalk for now. That is pretty great. And let's go and jump onto the bike again. And we're gonna 
collect all the codes. Okay, good stuff, guys. I think I'm just going to take the police bike out for a last spin around the block here. Make sure that everything is nice and legal here. And yeah, dude, it is looking pretty calm in the city right now. Of course, we do got all the military police vehicles roaming around. But those guys are working for the government. They're not bad guys, so I'm not going to bother them anymore today. So yeah, let's just go to check out this uh, neighborhood right here. A last little sweep around the city. And dude, it is looking pretty clean now. Dude, we literally cleaned up the city. Uh-oh, this car is illegally parked though. So yeah, and you know what? I'm just going to be nice and park it onto his property. I'm not going to give him a ticket or anything like that or get it towed away. So there we go. I'm like super, super nice now. Anyways, guys, that has been quite a successful day as a traffic enforcement officer in Brookhaven. And that's going to be it for today's episode. I really hope you enjoyed this one. And if you did, make sure to hit the like, subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.